Um, the um, as I say, the show just keeps going on as it as it does with everything else because why change it? I mean, you can't. You can only have them in so many angles. Um, at that point, and so this would air over the next three weeks as well. Um, and then I guess we're going to come back with, and what becomes made is a match. It's going to be a mystery opponent, fucking uh, Scott Hall and his mystery, I mean his mystery partner versus Raven and uh, Brian Lee. Mm -hmm. um, and uh, you know, three weeks after the last one. Right. But let's just go. Let's just say it's four weeks, okay? Let's just. So it gets it's us easy. into the next month. Well, let's just say four weeks because. June, July, August. I mean, it's it's harder because instead of booking three weeks into June and half into right. July, yeah, yeah. And so we're just we're gonna go monthly. Yeah, absolutely. So we're gonna so pretend we're the shows are monthly. Month and and we we've teased uh, Hall and his guest, you and Brian Lee, right, coming in July. Right. Um, I got an idea, but I gotta see if it's I gotta play it in my in my head now if it's gonna work. So I shut the camera off for half a second. All right, the camera's off about ten seconds as I played that out in my head. Um, the third week of TV before the match, um, we're gonna have a, we're gonna have a handheld camera, and uh, Scott Hall is gonna be holding the camera himself, um, and he'll be in a walk in through a night through a bar, some sleazy like you know some sleazy titty bar or something like that, and um, he'll be holding the camera on himself, and as he comes walking through, and then he'll turn it back and you know just show it, and he's like, and uh, here go here hold this and gives it to whoever he's with to hold it and all of a sudden you see my face come into view and boom he just sucker punches me and starts beating the crap out of me you know in some sleazy titty bar dive um as i go to uh as um as i go to rise up uh from the beating because instead of because scott hall wouldn't just keep beating you beating you beating you beating you beating you he would beat you up and then make you realize that you're taking a beating. You know what I mean? He wouldn't just knock you out. So as he stands back to gloat, he would go, oh, and by the way, here's my friend. So I know who his friend is now, but nobody else does. And I just got my ass beat. And we show a face of, we show some actual fear and panic in Raven's face, which we don't normally see. Um, you know, because usually Raven likes pain, but now he's just about shit his pants. Um... So only I know who it's going to be, but that's the last, uh, that's the last, let me think, would that be the last or would that be, yeah, no, I think that would be the last, because I think if, I think if I, if I made it two weeks in instead of, you know, if I made it, that would be the, that's going to have to be the last shot before the next uh, arena show. Mm -hmm. So that's the last shot uh, on the last Pulp Fiction. Like as the Pulp Fiction ends, you know, because, I mean, why mess with perfection? You know, the Pulp Fiction works. I mean, I don't know why anybody hasn't done it since, because you get, you know, you get, you can put any better music to it, but you get two, three minutes, you get 30 people over in two, three minutes, you know, because most guys can't cut a, a lengthy promo. But, and to be honest, all you need is 10 seconds to get over a character if you do it week after week after week after week. That's all you need. And, um... You know, so why fucking mess with perfection? So as the thing, you know, would wound down, and finally that would be the last thing you'd see. Because I would always like that when there was something really hot, how it would wind, all of a sudden it would go through all the stuff, and all of a sudden it would wind into the big piece, you know, the, the, meat, and, the meat and potatoes of it. And it would go off with whatever was uh, really necessary to build to the next thing. Um, so... Now we know what we're coming with, and we're like, holy fuck, you got to come to the show. You know what I mean? Because what the fuck? Raven actually is terrified. Um, we get to the thing. Uh, we get to the match, and uh, they're ready for the match. And then they, uh, Raven comes out first, and uh, and uh, Bulldozer Brian Lee, and Scott Hall comes out. And then all of a sudden, and his partner, and uh, let me see how I want to do this. Um... Do it a couple ways. Um, but you know what? The best way to do it is the simplest. Um, I could either, I, I was debating whether I either have them not be able to show up and postpone it a month hmm. because, not to fuck the fans, but because, you know, because Raven, you know, Raven put a stop to it. You know, he, he ambushed the guy in the parking lot, you know, Raven or Brian Lee did or whoever. Um, so I'm debating whether to do that or to actually have it. Um, now Raven would keep his mouth shut on TV when Joey Styles or whoever. No, said, no, 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 no. Well, yeah, Raven. Yeah, Raven would keep his mouth shut. But I'm debating which way to go with it. Um, and I think, 
let's see. I think I would draft. Um, I think I need more muscle at this point. So I think I would draft uh, Steve Williams to come in. Now, he arrives August of '96. I'm going to bring him in sooner um, because we're almost there anyway. Um, because I need some muscle behind me. So instead of coming in to fight me, I'd bring him in as my backup. And so as they announce, um, as they announce, uh, they announce Scott Hall and his partner, and they play the music, and no one comes out. And they play some music, and no one comes out. And I get on the mic, and I'm like, where's your partner, Scott Hall? And, uh, and he's like, what have you, you know, and basically Panama, what have you done? And then uh, I'm like, you know, well, you jumped me in a bar last week when we laid your partner out, you know. And I got me, and just in case you thought that uh, your partner was going to be uh, some sort of equalizer, well, you know, I brought my own, and, uh, and out comes Dr. Death in my side, and then the three of us destroy fucking Scott Hall. So me, Brian Lee, and uh, Dr. Death destroy uh, Scott Hall. Um, and we show the footage of Dr. Death and me beating up someone, but we never actually see who it is, like, over the next couple TVs, you know what I mean? You're never actually going to get to see who this is. I mean, it is, this, so this is, like, a really, I mean, this, this could, this, you know, like I said, I'm making this up as I go, so this could either work out really well. I mean, I, I'd give it a lot more thought if I was actually, uh, but this is off the top of my head, which mm -hmm. is always more fun to me. Ban Mr. Bloodclot, but never you can't ban him. I'm just not gonna read it. Oh. Now you can ban Mr. Bloodclot. If I see more trolling, it's gonna go up to five years.